Howdy folks, and welcome to Brain Rodders. We just got a Hawkeye Episode 5 trailer, and it's got a lot more yellow and Belova footage, so we gotta break all of it down, so stay with me. It also teases a lot more of Kingpin, so let's get into it. So first things first, this scene here of Hawkeye running through the black tie event we've seen from this other trailers before, but what makes this footage different now is that Hawkeye is now laid over with dialogue, saying that he's now made an enemy with a Black Widow, referencing Yelena, of course, which makes me think that this black tie event is something that Kate and Hawkeye likely attend to take down Kingpin, but is interrupted by gunfire, and I'm fully convinced that Yelena is sniping at him, similar to something we saw her do in her introduction in the Black Widow movie. Following that is new footage of Kazi saying, tell the boss that Christmas came early, which is only something a bad guy would say if they have one up the heroes of our story somehow, which leads me to believe a few things that could play out as a result of this line. One, Hawkeye's daughter got restless waiting for him to come home for Christmas, and she went back to New York to be with him and bring him home. However, she doesn't make it that far and instead bumps into Kazi in the tracksuits. And we know the tracksuits have a list of Hawkeye's family, so who's to say that Kazi doesn't know who Hawkeye's daughter looks like? So by telling the boss that Christmas came early, Kazi means that the tracksuits now have the means to one-up Hawkeye by kidnapping his daughter. Or two, I think this scene is likely when Kazi figures out that Hawkeye was Ronin and his boss, Maya, all she wants to do is find Ronin and avenge her father's death. So by saying tell the boss that Christmas came early, Early, he means that he'll finally be able to put this whole Ronin situation to bed once he tells Maya of who Ronin is, which is exactly what he wants. Remember from episode three and four, Kazi does not like how Maya keeps pursuing Ronin, so by finding out Hawkeye is Ronin, the tracksuits of Maya alike can stop searching for Ronin and take their vengeance finally and put it behind them. The way Kazi finds out Hawkeye is, is Ronin is up in the air, but I think it's more likely that he finds a picture of Hawkeye as Ronin or he finds the suit in Hawkeye's possession or, so, or something like that. The other new Yelena footage is really cool. We see her with a version of the baton that she was using in Black Widow, but zoom in a little closer, you can see that it's lined with dark red pieces of metal. So similar to her new gauntlets, I can see this baton having a flow of red electricity. Hey, you made this far, you might as well subscribe if you're new to Brain Rotters, as well as hitting that bell for notifications so you don't miss another video just like this one. As well, God bless. This scene here of Yelena Belova, you can tell that she is in Kate's apartment, meaning for whatever reason, Yelena is calling a truce and will likely join the fight against Kingpin in the track suits. I can see the reasoning for joining Hawkeye and Kate would to be likely to get something back that belonged to Black Widow that was stolen from the Avengers compound. Remember all those stolen items are still a part of the series still and I think Yelena wants to adopt all of Nat's things or something specific to Nat and it has everything to do with maybe something that track suits stole from the Avengers compound that belonged to Black Widow. A lot of you might think that this mansion footage in the trailer is from a flashback to the events of Black Widow, and while I do think this could be a flashback sequence, I'd argue that the vest that Yelena is wearing isn't her green one that she gave to Nat, meaning this scene takes place after the events of the Black Widow movie. Speaking of this mansion, I do think that it could belong to Kingpin, and Yelena begins to start targeting Kingpin and likely has another mission, another assassination attempt that Contessa Valentina has for Yelena. Now, as to how Yelena convinces Kate to team up, she is like blackmailing Kate or more likely Yelena tricks the young and wide-eyed Kate into trusting her which definitely I think is the case we do get the shot of an inflatable arrow launching some track suits which teases a lot more trick arrows are to come for the series which is really exciting we get this shot here of Hawkeye versus Yelena below but you can see the emotion in Yelena's eyes like she wants to kill Hawkeye. I can see this fight being very intense, and I hope there's a story in it. I hope we get to see just how far Yelena is willing to go, and how they incorporate Nat's death into this fight between the both of them, and by the end of the fight, if they will both see that each of them has lost their best friend, and they need each other, or if one of them will walk away a victor, and the other one will die. It's going to be really interesting to see how it plays out. We get this really cool shot of the three arrows, but check it out, guys. Hawkeye's arrows are adapting the purple wings from the comics. It's just so cool how Marvel's going so comic accurate recently. Thank you all so much for watching. I appreciate it. What are your expectations from Hawkeye Episode 5? Let me know your thoughts in the comments section below. I want to thank you all so much for the massive support. I am definitely blessed. Thank you all. God bless.